Hey there, Eco Warriors. Today's mission takes us into the fast lane of electric vehicles, but not everyone is hitting the accelerator. Hertz, the car rental giant, is taking an unexpected detour from their electric dreams. Let's find out why. As your host, I'm thrilled to welcome you back to Z Missions, your hub for all things impactful and eye opening. Today, we're diving into the latest twists in Hertz's EV journey. Hertz, known for its big push into electric vehicles, is making a strategic move, selling off a third of its electric fleet, roughly 20,000 vehicles. Now, the road to this decision is a bit bumpy. Despite the lower maintenance cost of EVs, Hertz executives spilled the beans about the financial roadblocks they're facing. Collision and damage repairs on an EV, as revealed by Hertz CEO Stephen Schur, can be twice as expensive as traditional gas-powered vehicles. Ouch. But here's the twist. It's not just about repairs. The declining prices of electric vehicles, primarily driven by Tesla, are causing a ripple effect. The resale value of Hertz's used EVs is taking a hit. Buckle up for the numbers. Hertz is bracing for a loss of about $245 million due to EV depreciation. That's an average of $12,250 per vehicle, according to their recent SEC filing. And speaking of Tesla, they're in the spotlight, making up a whopping 80% of Hertz's electric fleet. So what's Tesla got to do with it? Well, their aggressive price cuts are causing a chain reaction in the market. When new car prices drop, it pulls down the value of used ones, impacting companies like Hertz. In a nutshell, Hertz is hitting the brakes on a part of its electric fleet due to the unforeseen financial speed bumps. But hey, it's a dynamic road and strategies might shift gears again. Well, that wraps up our journey today, Eco Warriors. What are your thoughts on Hertz's electric detour? Drop them in the comments below. And don't forget to hit subscribe for more Eco Adventures. Until next time, stay charged and keep those wheels turning.